Hello, is on the camera? What's up, guys? We'll get ready to do a uh, clutch cut in here on this channel at some point. Here, you guys, about what, five more days? Monday, probably. Monday or so. So, uh, we'll probably end up doing a clutch cut in on his channel. So, we'll check that out. Uh, real quick, whatever, we're going to do the Tinley pickups from the spring. I didn't show anyone. I haven't really released too much. I think a couple people know, not too many. But we're going to show you what I did end up picking up at Tinley. So, the first one, if I can find it. Here we go. The first one, guys, was an Anchi Pinstripe Clown Hat VPI. So, we're going to add that to the arsenal. So I figured that was a good pickup. And that is a girl. Gorgeous snake, gorgeous snake. I actually got the color in that. And then, so this one here is very in particular. I'm gonna show you and tell you why. So this is kind of how you build a project too, a little bit, where you prepare for the future. So people are always thinking about this year's pairings and stuff like that, that's awesome. But you got to think about also four years down the road, three years down the road, so on and so forth. So, right now, I have the Red Stripe Enchi Cl Clown pairing to the Enchi Chocolate DG Hypo Girl. So you're going to hit triple heads, okay? With Red, Red Stripe Enchi Chocolate and it. So you can hit Super Enchi Chocolate Red Stripe. So be the ultimate outcome of that. Or, you know, a variation. So the idea is instead of trying to go head to head with holding those whole bags back, you try to add a little bit of something to it where you hit the better odds. So that's where this snake comes from. And this is a girl. So by the time that hopefully two years by the time I race her, the male and stuff like that will, you know, probably be ready or we'll have, you know, grow ups with them. So it'll be pretty nice. So. We're just getting ahead of the ball here. So we ended up picking up. Now she's already tagged me once. Nothing too crazy, but it is. Visually, so you have the GHI spot nose clown that's a hundred percent. Het DG Het Hypo. So you take a male, say out of, you know, the triple hats that have some sort of other um, incomplete genes in them. And we're increasing the odds on this by at least having one visual on the side. So that's why this is kind of an important pickup. So it's gonna be interesting. So it's kind of like with the future hold, just kind of how to build a project a little bit. With that, um, she was available and I was already starting to do that pairing, so I'm like, this makes sense. This is the project we're working for and we're gonna try to get a jump start on it. So that's definitely going to help. Plus we got other things coming as well. Uh, the Mojave Hypo Girls get right away. She's back there nesting really hard. Well, any day now really so we'll be doing a egg pulling video on that the first one of the year so we'll see how, how else things go we did a shed testing two with the dg fire spot nose pin 66 percent had hypo 50 percent had cryptic boy so we are going to shed test them for hypo and cryptic we're just waiting on the results so that's going to be interesting it could be a very powerful snake and it's just been kind of sitting there <laughs> oops um we also did a blackhead pin hypo. I actually just got them locking up to the red stripe cypress leopard head clown boy. So you can get red stripe cypress into that project and the hypo clown project. It's gonna be 50% head clowns, but 100% head hypo. Obviously you test for the uh, clowns, go from there. So uh, we're doing a podcast. Make sure we're, uh, you guys are Checking out the podcast and stuff as well. 
We have good times with that. So we try to keep, you know, probably on Friday, Saturday, just gonna have to, uh, we try to do a week in advance where we can spam them and stuff like that. So definitely have to check that out. Uh, it's kind of sporadic with the expos and stuff. So it just kind of varies. So I know they're kind of everywhere. It makes it kind of hard, but schedules are always posted for the expos on the Facebook page. So hope you guys like the update. Stay tuned. Uh, so we'll be pulling a clutch here in a couple of days and Will's going to be doing an egg cutting um, video. You going to do it on your YouTube or are you going to do it on this channel? YouTube. You're gonna do it on his, he's going to do it on his YouTube channel, guys. So we'll check that out and stuff and we'll post the link for that when he does it. So like, comment, subscribe, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Make sure you follow the Instagram as well. We're out. See you.